work it. I bet. <laughs> you know, they break when people take pictures of me. This year's Cane Hill Harvest Festival drew big crowds. We have Don Cart in his 1943 IA Super C. Dear H. Hi, Jack. Cane Hill Festival every year and see all the old timey sights and sounds. Just a great atmosphere down here. Love to see the old college building. And nice folks at Cane Hill. This year, uh, year's Cane Hill Festival was one of the best. Had a lot more activities going and the dancers. This is really overall good festival. The festival has been really great. A lot of people, big turnout. The parade was great. The food was great. Everything's been great, so... Following this year's festival, the Cane Hill College will be closed down for renovations. The project will start uh, with foundation work following the festival this year in October, putting original windows back in, the proper brick back into the, where the, you see the bright red brick, and the correct soft mortar instead of the hard mortar, and then focus on getting the inside back into good shape. It'll take about two years. It's going to be a two-phase project. The phase one will be stabilization, the roof, and the brick and mortar work outside, and then phase two will involve the interior stuff, as well as the site plan, making it a little more functional outside, improving sidewalks, parking, and that sort of We've been able to save the drugstore building. It was probably two to five years away from collapsing. It's on the National Register of Historic Places. We've also been able to stabilize the Methodist Manse, 1834, very old structure here in Washington County. And we look forward to getting a plan together for that in the future once we get the college project rolling. We've also made a new home in the Shaker Yates Special Store for the King Hill College Museum. We look forward to getting people in there on Saturdays, hopefully in the future, 10 to 4, 9 to 5. A place where people can congregate, uh, come and learn about King Hill history, research, read about the history. And so we've really got things improving around here.